Sir Richard Arkwright was born in 1732 in Preston. He was an English inventor and is credited with inventing the spinning jenny. This is Massa Mill, built in 1783 for Arkwright. He built it close to the River Derwin to take advantage of the greater water flow for his water mill. This is Cromford Mill, built in 1772. The site was chosen because it had a year-round supply of warm water. The mill started off with 200 workers, that's more than the population in that area, so he built housing to attract more people to come and work for him. Some of these houses can still be seen in Cromford today. Most of the employees were women and children, with the youngest being seven years old. Cromford Mill is the world's first water power cotton spinning mill. This is Cromford Wharf at the end of the Cromford Canal, which ran 14 and a half miles, completed in 1794 by William Jessup and assisted by Benjamin Outram. It used to carry coal, limestone, lead and cotton from the mills. This area is known as High Peak Junction and was where the Cromford and High Peak Railway met with the Cromford Canal. The railway was connected to Cromford Canal at one end and the Peak Forest Canal at the other. It did later link with the main line. We're now in one of the old sheds here. A few miles away, but still in Derbyshire, is Crestbrook Mill. The village didn't exist, but grew up around a textile mill. The first one here was built by Artright, but burnt down in 1785. His son Richard Jr. rebuilt it, and others later extended it. Today, they are private uh, apartments. This is St Mary's Church Cromford, next to Cromford Mill. Completed in 1797 and originally planned as a chapel for Willsbury Castle, which is the house Artright had built for himself over there in the distance. But unfortunately, he died before it was complete. His son Richard moved into it and the Artright family lived in there until 1922. These are the Artright graves of some of the family members that lived on the estate. Uh, but Sir Richard is actually buried in the crypt inside, along with some of the other members as well.